Hey guys, so if you're here to actually watch this update because you watched my last one, you're probably wondering, you're probably wondering why my hair is up in a nasty dirty bun. The reason is that when I flat ironed my hair, which was now um, like over a week ago, uh, I just did not have time to actually sit down and do this part, the talking part, and update you. I did film clips, so instead of sitting here with my hair flat ironed straight, I'm going to talk to you and show you clips of me measuring my hair and show you pictures of my hair and all kinds of good stuff like that. Um, before I show you the clips, I did want to mention that I think in my last video I said that my goal was tailbone length. And literally like a couple days after I posted that, I saw some pictures and I was like, this is my goal and I'll post a picture like here go you know I'll post a picture or I'll show you a picture so that is my goal and that is actually called um thigh length or uh classic length I don't know I think they're the same thing but anyways that's my actual goal and so yeah my goal changed and I don't know if I ever told you the dates I had set that I'm hoping to achieve like each goal. Like I have to get back to belly button length, I have to get back to hip length. I was kind of there at one point but my ends were really bad. Anyways, I have to get to that. Um, so I have specific dates set that I'm hoping to achieve those goals by with straight hair and with wavy hair. But you'll only be seeing my hair straight so that's the ones I'm going to talk about. So the date I have set to reach my belly button when it's flat ironed is November 18th of this year and it's going to be kind of... <laughs> my child just crashed into a box but it's going to be kind of... Um, I won't be filming an update in November. I'll be doing one in October and December. So you'll see my hair in October. It might be to the goal already. Honestly, it's pretty much almost there and you'll see that. You'll see that in my clips. But it's uneven and it's driving me insane because the woman cut my hair uneven. And please excuse me. I look like crazy right now. But anyway, so um, I think it'll be there before November. But you'll see my update in October. And then if not, you'll see my update in December. My goal for hip length straight hair is April 1st of 2018 so my goal for um, whatever I just said the one before classic is September 1st of 2018 and my goal for why can't I think of these things classic length is March 20th 2019 those dates are very far away and that's very depressing but I have to be realistic because I've been growing my hair out for four years and I keep setting unrealistic dates and it's um, really upsetting to think you're gonna get somewhere within like six months and then you're still like two inches away and it takes you like another year so I'm setting very far away goals and then I'm gonna show you one more thing and that is where my goal will be on me and it's gonna be on a pair of pants and you'll see where I've drawn a line that's where I want my hair okay so now that I've talked and talked and talked and talked I'm gonna show you the clips so I measured two ways this time instead of just one. I measured like from the top right here, you know, well you can't see right now, but from my roots all the way to the bottom. And when I measured that, as you'll see in the clip, my hair reached the 25 and a half inch line, which is actually crazy because I believe last month it was 24 inches, maybe a little bit past that. And then I measured from my earlobe to the bottom because I've seen another YouTube do that, YouTuber do that, 
and I thought that was a really good idea because it probably is more accurate because you're, you could get a different line like every single time at the top. So I measured for my earlobe. That ended up being 17 and a half inches. I think last time I measured on my green shirt, I'm no longer going to be using that one. I made a white one. You can see the lines much better. And I tried to do a clip, but it was just turning out different every single time. And I don't think it's an accurate way to measure it. So instead, I just did a picture. And I'll insert that here. And it's going to be hard to see, but I promise you, it's on the 13 inch line. And I did a shot to show you how close it is to my belly button. As you'll see, one half of my hair is like pretty much at my belly button and the other half is about a half inch away. I'm going to be getting a trim, a very small trim, tomorrow and I'm really hoping it helps to even it up. Even if it's just like that much, it'll help so much. So that is my update and I am so sorry my hair is like this. I swear it's never going to be like this again. I'll make sure I get my update in when my hair is flat ironed. So thank you for watching. I know I haven't posted many videos. I'm just, I'm just busy. I'm really busy. I started a really hard biology class and I'm working and I have a toddler. So it is what it is and I try to post when I can for me. So if you want to see any more of these updates or if you have any ideas to add just let me know and don't forget to like comment and subscribe thanks bye